They could have said, look, it's useless to resist. Nebuchadnezzar has so much power. He's the most powerful person on the face of the earth. Why throw our lives away for this one simple little musical of 20 minutes long? Let's just bow. We must live. Is it better for you to live and throw your convictions to the wind or die believing the principles of faith? He was saying death is better than compromise. How far will you be pushed before you decide to stand for something? Money will buy you the finest clothes, but not beauty. Money will buy you a house, but not a home. Money will find you, buy you the finest doctors, but only God can give you help. How far will you be pushed before you decide to stand for something. How far will you be put before you decide to stand for something? Our God is able, our God is able. I don't know what you're going through today, but I can tell you our God is able. It may be with your children, but I assure you our God is able. It may be in your marriage, but our God is able. It may be in your health, it may be in your finances, our God is able. I don't know the trial you're going through, but our God will bring you through it. Our God is able. He is Jehovah Shammah, the all-powerful, all-knowing God. In the book of Leviticus, he is our high priest. In the book of Numbers, he is the cloud by day and the fire by night. In the Psalms, he is our rock, our fortress, our high tower, our shield, and our buckler. In the New Testament, he is the lion of the tribe of Judah. He is the lamb of God. He is the prince of peace and the king of all kings. He is the alpha and the omega, the first and the last the one who was and is and evermore shall be. He is the sea walker and the blind man healer. When he says, peace be still, peace arrives. He is the fourth man in the fire. He is Emmanuel, God with us, the hope of glory. When Satan reminds you of your past, you remind him of his future. 